Sometimes God could give us warnings about things that are about to play out. In today's report, I want to give you a few separate predictions, both predicting the exact same event playing out in California. I believe that they could be onto something. In fact, geologists don't disagree with what they believe is going to happen in the very near future in the state of California. Two prophecies from two separate prophets, both claiming that a major earthquake is about to strike California. Check out this first article on the most importantnews.com. A bomb cyclone just hit California. Is this the key prophetic sign that John Paul Jackson warned us about? The article states, in 2011, John Paul Jackson warned that a major storm is going to come to California before the great earthquake that radically changes the geography of the state happens. He said that it would be a hurricane of incredible force or a storm of incredible force and that the storm would represent a sign that God would give to let people know that the big one is coming. Here's what John Paul Jackson actually said. There is an earthquake that has been predicted to devastate California, meaning skyscrapers are going to fall, and that the shape of the U.S. will change after that earthquake. That won't happen until after there is a storm, and a major storm is going to come to California. It's either a hurricane of incredible force, or it is a storm of incredible force. But a great, great hurricane our incredible force is going to come to California and the earthquake that destroys California will not happen until after that take place. What John Paul Jackson has just stated is that he believes that the Lord told him that there will be some kind of major cyclone or show of force in California. That will be the first sign. And then sometime in the future, there will be a major earthquake in California. Now, this is interesting because I just saw this article on usatoday.com and it's titled, An Unprecedented Bomb Cyclone Will Bring 100 Mile Per Hour Winds to the West Coast. Could it be that that's the cyclone of intense force that John Paul Jackson is talking about? Well, ultimately, you get to decide. But in a nutshell, he's not the only one making prophecies and predictions. Take a look at this article on themostimportantnews.com titled, California Earthquake Prophecy from Sandu Sundar Salvajari. This place will be torn like how a paper will be torn in two. Now, the article states, in 2015, Sundar was warned about the coming Great California earthquake for three days in a row. Now, here's what Sundar actually stated, and I quote, I was in Costa Mesa on June 19th for a conference among the Chinese people. One afternoon at 543, as I was preparing my message, the Lord Jesus walked into the room and he came and stood by the sliding door window overlooking Costa Mesa. He never spoke any words. He just looked. I was wondering what he was looking at. Then he motioned to me, come and stand beside me and said, as I was standing looking, this place will be torn like how a paper will be torn in two. When he said this place at that moment, I felt in my spirit, he was referring to California. Then on the 20th of June, the next day at 645 in the evening, a mighty angel appeared in my room with a scroll in his hand. He unfolded the scroll and began to read these people. Americans have been marked for destruction. When he spoke these words, I saw angels, many of them in many places over the U.S., standing ready to execute, to execute destruction upon the nation. I saw three places that were marked for massive destruction through earthquakes. I don't know what are the three places. I was just shown three. So I did some Googling and found there are three major faults in the U.S., the San Andreas and others in the middle of the U.S., and the third is somewhere else. After meeting in Costa Mesa the very next day, we were in Los Angeles Airport waiting to board a flight in Houston. While we were waiting, they made an announcement, boarding has started. So we were in the queue waiting to board. At that moment, I heard a voice, son of man, the city is going to be destroyed. So I turned around and there was an angel with a big weapon of destruction in its hand. I saw this angel standing beside me. And at the same time, I also stand him, saw him standing outside the airport. The angel stood beside me and near that encounter restaurant at the same time. This is the same angel. But when he stood outside, he appeared so huge that his head touched the clouds and he had this huge weapon of destruction in his hand like looked like a sledgehammer you know like the one Thor has like that and he said this city will be destroyed by a great earthquake
As you just saw, Sundar is also predicting a massive California earthquake. Now, whether these two men actually heard from the Lord or not, well, I guess that's for you to decide. But in the end, it's not only prophets predicting something major and cataclysmic is coming to California. In fact, geologists have been saying it for quite some time. Take a look at this article on... The Remnant.info. After 100,000 earthquakes in California, the big one is coming, says geologist. Now that's a recent article. In all honesty, it's not a matter of if a major earthquake is going to strike California, because we all know it is. We just don't know when and where. Anyhow, please don't forget to check out my partner at noblegoldinvestments.com. Right now, I want to encourage you guys to convert your 401k into something backed uh, by gold, silver, precious metals, these kind of things. We are literally about to hit an unstable uh, time in the economy, and I am encouraging you guys, please make sure you have something backed uh, by gold, silver, and precious metals. I do not want you guys to lose any investments that you have. So give them a call today. Anyhow, thanks again for tuning in. I'm Lisa Haven, signing out.